Hey guys, it's Liz and welcome to my channel. Today is going to be an unboxing, as you can see, from the thumbnail and the title. So, so normally, I think I've stated this before, I have a normal subscription through BoxyCharm every three months. I do get an upgrade to the Boxy Lux. So traditionally, I believe it's 230 something dollars for the annual subscription. And then every three months I get charged an additional $30 totaling to $50 for each Boxy Lux. So I was on Boxy Charms um, Instagram and I saw that they had a whole box dedicated to Fenty Beauty products. And I'm like, cool, I'm going to get the Boxy Lux for the March subscription. I'm going to have all Fenty. I was already planning what I was going to do with the items. Da, 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 da. I was wrong. That was specifically for the Boxy Premium, which is different from the Boxy Lux. Great. Um, I was really looking forward to that Fenty highlighter, the gold one. Oh my god. Kilowatt something. But, no, sadly, I still got the Boxy Lux, but it was not the Fenty box. Can you tell my disappointment? Anyways, like I normally do before I film these videos, I try on the items, so I already know what's in this box. However, I do like to show you guys what it looks like when I try these items on instead of just like, hey, I have this item, you know, don't know how it is, never tried it. But I can say that I've tried these items. So anyways, let's move on to the box. So this is the different size um, than normal. Like it's like, Jesus, it's like bigger than my head. <laughs> but anyways, so last um, month for the February, it's pretty basic. I saw the, um, but it says bo boxy looks on it. But um, we're gonna fold her down. So I saw some unboxings already. And, um, and last month they gave us, or whatever, the BoxyCharm members, the virtual or digital, um, list of everything you're receiving. There's a little whatever. But this time they gave us the actual slip again. I don't know why. BoxyCharm, go back to the digital. I guess some people were complaining, but everybody just throws these out. Like, I don't know who collects these besides boxy charm themselves so anyways i guess this theme is pretty edgy which is written on a stone on the bottom um whatever so here we go so these are all the items in the box and i'm gonna go over them so before i go into these items and show you what we got in today's box in this month's box um this will be a giveaway there are about maybe five items out of these eight items that I will be giving away and stay tuned to the end to figure out what it is and what you need to do in order to get submitted for a chance to win this giveaway so first thing I'm going to reach for is the biggest thing and it is this this is the PMD um, clean smart facial cleansing device um, this was retailed for about $99 um, cordless, anti-aging, facial massage, beauty of silicone, whatever, you know, fancy, what they try to sell you, whatever. Um, so that's one of the items. The next item is the Murad Hydrodynamic Ultima Moisture for Eyes. And this retails for $70. Okay. Anyways. The next item is the... Spongel, spongele. Why did I say that? <laughs> I'm so stupid. The spongele. Well, there's a little accent on the e, but whatever. Spongele, Fresa Pear, Beyond Cleansing Body Wash Infused Buffer. It is vegan for all skin types. 100% paraben free, um, and it's cruelty free. So we're gonna open her up. And she smells amazing. I'm not gonna lie. This smells really, really good. Oh, anyways, um, it's in the shape of a daisy, but it's a sponge. And so here, the next items are together, um, but separate. <laughs> this is the Sol de Janeiro. The only reason I know how to say this is because I've heard other people say that, and I only saw the. De Janeiro, and I was gonna say something completely different. 
because it it's in script and my dumb ass can't read script but I try um anyways <laughs> tangent um so this is the Sol de Janeiro Cocoa Cabana Cream um an instant rush of hydration for visible luscious skin and lasting moisture which is the blue one and then the next one is the Sol de Janeiro Brazilian Bum Bum Cream um which is the yellow one and together they retail for $15 Next is the Bombshell Bakery Metal Straws, which there they give you like four of them, if I can count. Uh, yeah, they give you like four of them, and then a little clean, a little cleaner, a little straw cleaner to go in between them. They each have like maybe ten ridges on them. I don't know why these straws have ridges on them. They're not bendable. <sighs> which whatever. Anyways, let me stop complaining. But this was one of the items I got to choose, and also the um, Murad one was the one I got to choose. So, the next item is these NARS um, Power Matte Lip Pigment. Now, this is equivalent to a liquid lipstick in my eyes. It was very pigmented, which is the one I have on now. No, which is the one I have on now and one swipe will do you justice but just for safety measures I always put two anyways and it's in the shade called London Calling 2761 okay and again I couldn't hold it any longer anyways so I don't personally like, like the wand I like the Delpha applicators or you know the one that have a little slant. This one doesn't have a slant. This is very skinny. And I don't like it. I like the ones with a slant. It's easier for application. Okay, so the next item is the Boxy Charm Hello Charmer Shimmer Pressed Eyeshadow um, and Matte Pressed Eyeshadow Palette. So let's turn it out. Ooh, ah, anyways, so it's vegan and cruelty free, there's a little buddy, well actually it's not vegan, I lied, it just says it's cruelty free, so it does normally have a little, ooh, this is actually really pretty, I'm not gonna lie, look at that, Damn. okay, and I will show you close ups because I did record myself, this entire eyeshadow look was done with this palette, um, so I first, I'm going to pop up the little image, I first started using the color Unboxing, which is like a brick red color, which doesn't appear that color in the eyes. It's more like, I don't know, muted red, whatever. So I started using Unboxing, and then next I used Swipe Up, which is the pressed glitter formula, I guess. I don't know. But this glitter formula reminds me of like my childhood. I don't know if it was those little squishy things with glitter in them or I don't know I can't put my finger on it but if I find it while I'm editing this video I will pop it up somewhere but um yeah I used to swipe up on the lids and then I use this golden Lux shade this golden whatever it's called Lux this golden shade on my inner corner and then I use spoiler on the bottom inner lash line and then I use Cup of Joe on the outer bottom lash line and then I also use pop up on top of the Lux um, shade so yeah um I can't say I, I'm, I'm not a review channel again but um I love the swipe up shade it was beautiful um I can't speak to any of the other colors Lux and pop up were really beautiful on the eyes unboxing these these are all fine shadows um I think this retails for um $39 Jesus <sighs> I mean I can't complain my collection is outstandingly so expensive all right the next palette is the Zueva Premier palette Again, if I haven't heard anybody say it before, I would have probably mispronounced it. The name Zoeva. Anyways, so here's the Zoeva blush palette, blush and highlight palette. So, 
Oh my god, I just realized that when you open it up, it's a face. I don't know if you can see. Wow. I'm an idiot. <laughs> I didn't even realize that. That's so cool. Hmm. Anyways, so I use the shade 1929 for highlight, and I use the shade Curtain Call for blush. With the shade 1922, um... You're definitely going to need to build it up. It's, it's more of a subtle highlight if you just dip it into the um, pan and go for it. Um, you're going to need to layer up if you like that blinding um, highlight effect, which I do, which is what I did. And for Captain Call, um, a lot of fallout. Uh, and when I dipped into it, I got it all on my sweatpants that I was wearing when I was doing my makeup, <laughs> which was great. And you can hear my dog sparking. How fucking rude. I don't have time for this, y'all. I really don't. Curtain call. One swipe is all you need. Um, and just apply it with a brush. Um, but anyways, that was the last item in this box. So some of you have been able to be great detectives and realize which ones I will include, which items I will include in the giveaway versus the items I will not be including in the giveaway, which include these four items, which is the NARS lipstick, liquid lipstick, the Zoeva blush and highlight palette, and the Hello Charmer um, eyeshadow palette, and the straws will not be given in the giveaway. Moving on to the items that will be included in the giveaway. This month's box was very skincare heavy and I'm don't really care about skincare I should but I don't and not that I have great skin because I break out sometimes but like I just don't mm, things I don't care about so um I will be giving away uh, more of the skincare based products for instance the PMB hundred dollar facial cleansing device will be in the giveaway the Murad Hydrodynamic Ultimate Moisture for Eyes retail value seventy dollars will be given in the giveaway. The Spongel um, Beyond Cleansing Body Wash Infused Buffer that's shaped like a daisy will be given in the giveaway, which is either sixteen or nineteen dollars retail value. I will pop it up if I'm wrong, but three dollars difference. And the Zol de Janeiro Brazilian Bum Bum Cream and the Zol de Janeiro. Coco Gabbana Cream will both be given in the giveaway. Retail value $15. If you want these items, <coughs> mm. oh man. So the total retail value of all the items given in the giveaway are above $150. And if you want to enter, just be subscribed to my channel and comment down below anything you want an emoji a space nothing whatever so comment down below also a way for me to contact you to let you know you have won the giveaway so your instagram handle your snapchat handle your twitter handle your email address anything you want however this is public information these comments are public to anyone and everyone so if you do not want to don't give me a personal cell phone number, please don't. <laughs> um, uh, if you don't want to put anything too personal on there, just, I don't know. But keep in mind, it is public, so I guess the safest bet would be an Instagram. So if you like this video, please like, uh, comment, and subscribe because YouTube makes me say this. And if you watch the video all the way through, please comment down um, <clears throat> A girl putting on her makeup or the lipstick emoji or anything in reference to skincare and or makeup <coughs> Jesus so yeah bye